for those of you who are QC Calc users and you're using QC Calc real time to export data to Reaction Plan Manager Plus Plus, you should pay attention to this video. QC Calc Real Time version 3.4.83 had some modifications made to the export file format, which may cause problems. Well, actually, it, it will cause problems in the earlier versions of Reaction Plan Manager Plus Plus. So, if you are running Q QC Calc Real Time version 3.4.83, you should update your Reaction Plan Manager Plus Plus to at least version 1.0.37. I'm going to go over the changes you need to make to Reaction Plan Manager Plus Plus to support these modifications. I'm also going to open up a project and show you how to change a project accordingly. Let's start by changing the default data source in Reaction Plan Manager Plus Plus. Click on the About button, then click on the Settings button. Then you'll notice the default data source is now set to ProLink Export Becker Quality Solutions Reaction Plan Manager Plus Plus. If I click on this drop down box, you'll notice a new entry ProLink Export after version 3.4.82 Becker Quality Solutions Reaction Plan Manager Plus Plus. We'll click on this setting to change the default data source and save it. And that takes care of the default data source. Now, let's open up a project and change the data collector so that it will accommodate the, uh, the updates. So, I'm going to open up this Op10 basic example, then click on the data collector, and then I'm going to click on the set data file properties. And here you'll notice uh, it still has a ProLink export Becker Quality Solutions Reaction Plan Manager Plus Plus. That setting gets saved with the project. So you're going to have to go in and update each project, change this entry to, to read Be uh, ProLink export after version 3.4.82 Becker Quality Solutions Reaction Plan Manager Plus Plus. I'll save the settings and load the data. It's going to ask me, a solution already exists for the requested file to load. Would you like to purge all the reaction plans and start a new solution from scratch? And you're going to say no. And you'll notice, if I look at the, the data file, you'll notice that uh, I've got 18 header records that are defined. And the record 18 is actually part data. When you export the data from the QC Calc version 3.4.83, this row entry is, is another trend analysis um, information. So we want that to be a header record. But for now, since I've not exported any data from QC Calc real time, we're still looking at the old data file. When you set the default file properties for an existing project, uh, you will lose your filters and your configuration data collection setting. Uh, the configuration data collection setting is the column which identifies, uniquely identifies the part data. So for QC Calc, you want to click on column A for this setting. For your filter, go ahead and reset your filter, whatever that may be for your particular application. For this particular application, my column is column AA and it's the machine. So I'll add that filter. Now all my settings have been modified and now I'm ready to go. So I'll simply save that and that'll resolve the issue with the different the later late, latest version of QC Calc real time. Go ahead and apply those same changes to all your other projects that uh, you know that you've got that you're currently using.